When you arrive in Bombok Park Villas, we want you to feel immediate serenity. You park your scooter, you take off your helmet, and you hear birds singing. Then you walk down the pathway to your villa in a lush tropical garden. The land slopes from the street down to the river 10 meters down. So we place 12 houses on the land and from house to house we're going down terraced to catch as much sunlight as we can. The house is shaped like an L. It has the living area which has the high pitched roof which also functions as a barrier to the neighbor so the neighbor cannot look in. And then it has the bedroom area which has a very low roof. In Bali we have two types of weathers. It's either sunny as hell or it's raining cats and dogs. And we want to create a roof that protects us from both these weather types. It's long and overhanging. It has a high pitch so when it rains the water floats down quick. We push the roof up to create an area with all these louvers. So these louvers are here to give us cross ventilation. We sit down here on a hot day, the air floats into the house, it floats up, it does a turn and out the louvers. That way we have constant airflow here and it's always nice and cozy, even though outside it's really hot. Indonesia has a lot to offer. It has beautiful natural stones, it has amazing wood, beautiful tiles, bricks, terracotta, everything is here and we like to source locally. I think a house built in Indonesia should be built using Indonesian materials. When you stay in Bumbok Park, you're staying in an island within the island. You have the pool in the center where you can refresh yourself. You can go under the wooden roof that protects you from the element. You can go inside your bedroom that looks outside into the pool and into the garden. And you have the walls around the villa which cocoon you and which shut you off from that loud outside world.